thank all of you, especially my family and friends, for being here. It means a lot to me. So thank you very much. Now, I've done a lot of shows in the D.C. area, and I actually got recognized once, which was amazing. A guy comes up to me and says, aren't you www.facebook.com slash Jeff Eisen Comedy? <laughs> and I said, you don't have to call me by that right address. So he said, okay, Jeff, where do you get your ideas for your edgy, topical, political brand of humor? <laughs> and I said, I said, it comes from real life situations and conversations with my family and friends. And to prove that, my son's here with friends from college, and I think they're going to recognize <laughs> So I took my son to college for his freshman year. We're walking around the dorm. We go into the laundry room, and there's a box with free condoms. <laughs> See? It's true. Free condoms in the laundry room. And that's great. So I was surprised to hear that the Trojan Company did a survey it's the Trojan Company, not the Greek people, the Trojan <laughs> Company, did a survey of sexual openness on college campuses, and his school was rated 10th in the country. 10th! They have three condoms in the laundry room, and they're only 10th. So the first nine, deliver them by room service? Three condoms in the laundry room. What do they keep in the library? Scented oils? <laughs> And is my son going to associate laundry with sex his entire life? <laughs> this could be a problem. <laughs> That's why you never know. I mean, you can't be funny with me. <laughs> and it gives a whole new meaning to fluff and fold. <laughs> three condoms in the laundry room, but there's no free fabric softener. How's a guy supposed to get any action if his sheets aren't soft? <laughs> My name is Jeff Eisen. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jeff.